guys, what do we have here? Well, basically, a guy on Steam that just added me uh, had some problems with attaching a brush to a weapon. Uh, so here I made a test, basically, to find out what is working and what we can do with it. The brushes. Uh, so basically, here we have an AK, and they are all na a named AK, and then a number, basically the number from 1 to 8, from left to right. So 1, 2, 3, 4, etc. And every brush in front of it is attached to the weapon behind it. So yeah, so we can actually we can re easily see here which weapon that is working and now which uh, brush that is working and the first brush that come up is a normal fist box and nothing special about it uh, this is a fist box on underscore multiplayer and it will be destroyed after taking 100 damage uh, this is a funk underscore brush and there's nothing really you can do about that one I think Maybe I'll always sold it. Yeah, let's try it. Um, and we have a Funk underscore breakable that we break after 100 damage as well here. We have a Funk underscore door that is use opens. We have a Funk underscore do door rotating, same flag. And we have Funk illusionary, uh, nothing special about it, I don't know, really know what it is. Uh, we have a funk underscore button that use activates and when I press it it will kill AK7 which is this AK right here and it will also open the door right next to it. It will open the door that is named hello. So yeah, let's try this out. Okay lovely audience, let's try this out. So first we had a funk underscore fist box. Nothing special about it, you can shoot it, although I do not think yeah it can penetrate it so that's nice uh, but yeah you can set it so that you cannot penetrate it of course in the flags this one is a funk underscore fist box multiplier works as well hmm doesn't seem to get destroyed though kind of sh kind of a shame wow okay there we go just needed 100 damage yeah. Uh, next one was a funk underscore brush, and that did not work. And that's the thing. My last tutorial, I think I told you to have used a funk underscore brush. I'm sorry about that. Uh, next, we have a breakable. Okay, next time I'm not using so much HP on these things. There we go. 100 damage and it gets destroyed. Next up, a funk underscore door. If I press E, it opens. Does it? Yeah, it automatically closes. <laughs> That's kind of weird. It, but it does work. I don't even... Okay, there's some bugs with it, as you can see, so... <laughs> oh god. Oh god. That, oh my god, that is, that's just amazing. Oh god, where is it now? Oh god, I, fu I fucked it up. No, I didn't. Oh my god. Oh god. <laughs> okay, so do not use a door because, yeah. Oh, unless you want that, that's kinda weird. Uh, next up <laughs> is door rotating. So it rotates when I press E and of course we're gonna throw it on the ground and we're not gonna use it yet. Can we get it to fly down better? Oh, come on. Well, I guess that's it. Okay. Uh, next one was a funk underscore illusionary, and that doesn't seem to work. That's bad. Although we're gonna use that AK, right? So let's place it right next to our door that is called hello. And this is the last one, funk underscore. What was this? This was a button. Connection of lost. Okay. 
And yeah, one thing more, uh, move linear also I think works, and I guess some other stuff like tank trains I guess you can use. But yeah, these are just some things that you could use. And this is a button, so when I press this the door should open and this AK should disappear. Okay, the door is open. Did I mess up with the uh, killing? Or did I, isn't that... Maybe the names disappear when you do that. Yeah, but okay, the door opening and closing works fine. I wonder what happens if you press it when it's like this. Okay, that's nothing bad with that. <laughs> that's too bad. Where is it? <laughs> Where are you going? Come back. Come back. Come here. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, thank you for watching this tutorial, guys. This has been really funny. Um, yeah. See ya. <laughs> Where are you going? Come on. Come here, door. Where are you? <laughs> uh, thank you for watching this story, guys. Yeah, see ya. <laughs>